mosquito bite causing a rare brain deformity in newborn babies. A mosquito-borne virus cause babies to be born with abnormally small heads. Zika virus, which first appeared in Brazil in last May was the culprit. The virus was first isolated in 1947 in the Zika forest in Uganda in a rhesus monkey. The disease is spread by Aedes mosquitoes, and is similar to dengue fever and chikungunya. It causes mild fever, rash, red eyes, vomiting and headache, lasting for up to a week and rarely death. Zika virus infection during pregnancy harms the growing fetus. Pregnant women hit by the virus are likely to give birth to microcephaly. Microcephaly is a rare congenital birth defect marked by small head with abnormal brain development. Microcephaly causes cognitive or developmental problems. It is diagnosed when a baby's head measures less than 33 cm in circumference, compared to the normal 33 to 38 cm. Recent months, Brazilian health officials have noted an unusually high number of babies born with microcephaly compared to previous years. This year, health officials have already recorded 1,248 suspected cases of microcephaly. Fiocruz, a Brazilian scientific institute, found the Zika virus in the amniotic fluid of two pregnant women whose fetuses had been diagnosed with microcephaly. A finding that links the birth defect to the virus. According to Dr. Klebelius, an infectologist at the Federal University of Rio Grande do Norte, 80% of the mothers whose babies had microcephaly had Zika viral eye infection in their first trimester. They have identified Zika virus from the tissues of babies born with microcephaly. Eds mosquitoes carry this virus, live around the world. Slowly the virus is spreading to previously unaffected areas also. For pregnant women, it is important to follow antenatal routines and avoid exposure to Aedes aegypti mosquitoes that transmit disease. There is no vaccine nor specific treatment for Zika infection. Prevention of Zika infection is based on protection against mosquito bites and vector control. If not, a very big health hazard, we are going to face in the near future. Thanks for watching. Please click the link in description for more information.